Hey, this is Jade from Support the Scene. I'm here with another tip and trick. Hey, this is Linz, and you are watching Support the Scene. Now, one thing that uh, as a band and as a musician, you really want to do is get your music out there to people, right? So, you know, you post about it on your social media, but you're only reaching a certain amount of people that already like you, you know? You're sending it to your friends, you're posting to, you know, already people who already know you. Um, it's kind of hard to reach a bigger audience. So, if you hire a PR person, let's look at the benefits and the cons of doing so. So one of the benefits is obviously they have more reach and contacts for people who might listen to your music. So you might do uh, get into some blogs or uh, some you know review sites, um, maybe even to some YouTube videos. I know I do one minute reviews and uh, people send me stuff all the time. One of the cons, obviously the cost, you're paying someone for a service it costs money, it costs uh, a good chunk um, sometimes. Is it worth it? That depends on what you think, uh, you know, is the end goal. If you're just trying to get out there and to get your music out there, really do the research on the company, see who they've done work with in the past, see, you know, how many likes those posts have gotten, how many views the videos that they're promoting have gotten or the single, how many listens they've got on Spotify, you know, just so you can kind of gauge because take it from me, uh, as someone who does reviews and interviews, we get hundreds of emails a day, um, from the same, uh, you know, people promoting different bands and whatnot. Now, you know, we don't get to post all of them. We don't get to review all of them. Sometimes we kind of just go through the motions and copy and paste what the press release said um, and put it up on our site and we call it a day. I've seen that done a lot of times uh, when we hire someone to promote our music. I just kind of go to a site that kind of like regurgitates um, what we told in our, uh, you know, in our press release. On the flip side, you can get people that actually listen to the album and give you an actual full review or, you know, check it out and, um, you know, give it a breakdown of the album or whatever. Um, but it kind of depends on, you know, if people are watching those people, if they actually have an audience. And then also, if they do, are those audience interactive? Are they going to actually click your link, check out your music, or are they just going to keep scrolling because they don't know you? Um, it's just one of those things that you have to keep in mind before you sink, you know, five hundred to a thousand dollars in PR, because uh, it's essential to do so. You have to do some type of PR. You can't just put out a record and hope for the best. Uh, I love that your mom's going to listen to it, but that's about it. Uh, so PR is very important and getting it out there is fantastic. So many great PR companies and people out there to work with. Um, but do your research, be uh, a little cautious and really ask a lot of questions. You know, don't badger them because they are professionals and they do this for a living. But you can definitely ask some questions about their reach, about, you know, kind of thing. And yes, it does depend on what you're putting out. If you do um, you know, a bunch of recordings with your phone. It's not going to get the same traction as a really great sounding record or a really cool video. Um, so, you know, keep it in mind, look at the product. Is it worth, uh, you know, investing in? If you think it is, obviously, then go for it. But do a little bit of research and check out all the options you have. Look at what other bands have done, who they've worked with. Maybe even ask them, you know, hey, we're thinking about working with so-and-so. What happened? What did, how was your experience? We're a community. We support each other. At least that's what we should do. Keep rocking, keep supporting each other. Um, you know, check out all our other videos, hit that subscribe button, all that good stuff. And I'll see you later. Bye. Thanks for watching. This is Support the Scene. Make sure to subscribe, hit the bell, follow, and share. Thank you.